I was like flying through. Just lane splitting, no, no gear on. Look at that dude. I, there's no way I'm riding like that. Hey, anyway, welcome to the channel. I'm on my way to Pro Italia. I'm on my way to Pro Italia to uh, just do some service on the bike. I am going to, uh, this weekend I'm going to the Aprilia race track day at Laguna Seca. So this will be the third time um, I've gone to Laguna Seca. The last two times with, was with, with Ducati revs and I uh, took my Ducati before SP both times. So this time I'll be taking the 660. Um, I think it'll be fun. It's a big track. It's probably better suited for your leader bikes. But, um, no, I think it'll be fun. Uh, Philly is going to have all their bikes there. They are actually going to uh, demo them. You can uh, take one of them for a, for a session. So I think I'm going to probably take the RSV4, I think. You know, it's kind of like, do you want to take someone else's bike on the track? I don't know. I, I might do that, but looking forward to it. Uh, it's on Monday, coming up this Monday. July 22nd and uh, me and Cali 750 will be going up there in our tra in, in the RV uh, going up there uh, the day beforehand so it's in Monterey California and there's uh, I got a couple other friends that will be going up there so it should be cool so I'm just taking my bike to Pro Italia as you guys know Malcolm Smith is probably 20, 20 minutes from my house. Pro Italia is an hour and I got to deal with this traffic, but I'd rather drive two hours or ride two hours to Pro Italia than go across the street to Malcolm Smith because Malcolm Smith's service sucks. Okay, all positive. So Pro Italia, uh, those guys are cool. Um, you know, so my Prilia only gets touched by Pro Italia and Moto Club of Santa Monica or now Moto Club of Los Angeles. Okay, so those two shops. I was gonna take it to the Moto Club, but there's, I knew I was gonna deal with this kind of traffic, doing all this lane splitting, and it's probably like about 15 more minutes of lane splitting if I go to Moto Club Los Angeles. And I was like, ah, oh, just, I'll go here to Pro Italia. Pro Italia is actually the same exit as, um, if you guys are local and you guys are familiar, um, ACH. So you ride that, uh, that canyon. So yeah, this lane splitting is not ideal. You know, it's all these um, commuters commuting to work and all this traffic. Is there someone behind me? So yeah, apparently I was riding for a little while and I didn't know that one biker was behind me. The guy in a Harley with no gear on. Now I have, I don't have sleeve arm gear, but I have my chest protector. I got my boots and I got my uh, summer um, riding pants with have some type of protection but I'm taking it easy I'm I'm chilling that's why when the guy ran up on me behind me I really didn't you know recognize him until I looked in my Rizoma mirrors but any of you guys know any of you guys who have Ro Rizoma uh, mirrors you know or if you don't you can't really see out you really can't see out of them unless you move your hand you got to move your your um, your clutch hand and on the other side you got to move your throttle hand just to see out of the mirror but they look good so <laughs> so I wanted to be at the shop at 9 o'clock as soon as they open that's not gonna happen it's so crazy how long it takes to get on your bike when you're leaving like you got to get your gear and then you know I'm trying to bring some stuff with me so I can work and then you forget this and you forget that you got to get your uh... see this guy crossing the white line so that's what we got to watch out for so anyway uh... I will uh start talking again probably when we get closer to the uh, closer to Pro Italia I could always be the one you want to call when it's cold outside I will always be the one that's right
Ducatis, Prilias, Busas. Hopefully it won't take too long. All right, thanks for watching. Peace. Have a great day. Have a great week. Have a great month.